Let me show y'all how I get down with the get down. So when you get the crab, you pull this leg out first. Hopefully some meat come with it. Mm -mm -mm. If you limited on your supply, I eat the lower legs too. Everybody gets chomped down on. Get whatever meat in them joints. The lower leg, little meat hanging. Mm. I got some garlic butter I made myself, which is um butter. Melted butter and garlic, which y'all can see is almost gone. Next leg. Sometimes the meat come out with it. You can might can crack it, see some extra meat come out. I be pressed for all the meat. I don't be trying to throw away nothing. You hear me? A little bit of meat. Dip it in the bottom. Mm. Oh my goodness. Crack it open. It's that extra meat. A lot of people don't pay attention to that extra meat. A lot of people throw them little skin legs away. Back in the day, when I used to go to, and you want to pull this one out too. Mm hmm. So, back in the day, when I used to go to the crab trap, that little crab trap that um, used to sell it by how much you got. So, I'd be like, give me $2.37 worth of crab. <laughs> Uh, depending on how many crabs I got, do you want to pull this one out? All right. Ain't no meat. What do you come with? So, there go a little bit of that. Then you got to pull this part apart. Pull that out. Might be a little bit of meat, but you got your mallet. For the big legs. So you get your little mallet. And then you just dig all the meat out. See the meat? Mm, that about it. I gotta make some more. Make some more butter in a minute. Throw that away. Pull off the other one. A little meat on there. It's really not. The thing about Dungeness, now Dungeness crabs be having meat in the inside of the top of the crab, too. Dungeness crabs, to me, oh my God, got the most meat. Like, when I get crab legs, okay, so crabs, I get a dozen of crabs. If I get crab legs, I get four to five pounds of uh, snow crab legs. Or if I get Dungeness, then I get, like, three pounds, two, two to three pounds because... Dungeness got so much meat in them, it's ridiculous. So you crack it open. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Crack it open. Then with the males, the males got this little thing right here. The females, the little thing is up here. It don't have no extension. So with the males, they got the little extension right here. So all you do is open up that flat. And once you open it up, Rip it off. Then you're going to take your thumb. Take your thumb and stick it in this. See the little hole right there? Or your finger. Whatever you want to do, stick it in that hole. And then you pull it apart from the shell. Once you pull it apart from the shell, me personally, I like to clean the dead man fingers off. That's what they call them, the dead man fingers. So I clean the dead man fingers off. And then I crack it. Crack it like a breast. Crack it open. Then you can get the little meat from right here, the little part right here. Get the little meat from out of out of here. I don't like all this extra stuff that be on top of the all the little yellow gooey stuff. I don't like that. All I want is meat. I don't want nothing but the meat. Then you can smash it. So the chest part, you can smash it like this. I ain't mean do it that hard. I did it pretty hard. And then dig in. And then it's kind of separated when you open it up. Where you can dig into where the meat is. 
Once you dig into where the meat is, you're good to go. Thank you, baby. Right. Pull the meat out, and your shell should look like this. It should be no meat in this chest cavity. <laughs> you should wipe out all of the meat. <clears throat> Once you get that, you get all of the meat. Okay?